Welcome to Talk in NEP, everyone. I'm your host, Gary Perna. This week, we are joined by Mary Malone, the president of the Greater Hazleton Chamber of Commerce. In this half hour, we're going to talk all about the chamber, what they do, how you can be involved in it, and how they're not only here to support the business community, but the entire community as a whole, with many events they hold throughout the year. All that we're going to talk about, and we're going to get to know the Greater Hazleton Chamber of Commerce when we come back here on Talking NEPA. It's spring, and savings are in the air during the spring sales event at All-American Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. Shop our large inventory and drive off with a great deal. Lease a new Jeep Compass Latitude 4x4 for $189 a month. And during Ram Truck Month, get select Ram 1500 4x4s for as low as $32,890. Or get 0% for 72 months on the Ram 1500. Savings are in the air during the spring sales event at All-American Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. Do you like craft beer? Do you want to learn the right way to sample wine? How about visiting a restaurant that has a unique flavor? These are just some of the things we'll be featuring on our show. Wine, hops, and road stops. Jeff Bonomo and his co-host, Alan Gennetti, welcome you into the world of craft beer, great wine, and good food. Wine, hops, and road stops. Life in the Monastery, the new CD by the Sisters of Holy Annunciation Monastery, can be yours for only $18, which includes shipping and tax. Mail a check to Holy Annunciation Monastery, 403 West County Road, Sugarloaf, Pennsylvania, 18249, or call 570-78-1205. This fantastic CD can be yours for only $18. In a world where an instant tweet can create a firestorm of news coverage, WYLN is moving with the times, allowing for more instant reporting of breaking news on television and on social media, as well as regular hourly news updates. News gets out faster than ever before, and WYLN brings it all to you. Live weekdays at 5.30 only on WYLN, where your local network. And welcome back to Talking NEP, everyone. I'm Gary Pern. I'm very pleased to have with me Mary Malone, the president of the Greater Hazelton Chamber of Commerce. Good dear friend of mine. I always love having you on Talking with us. Thanks, and I'm so excited. I love the new name and the new logo. Mm -hmm. So glad to be one of your first for yeah. your new show. So uh, I want to bring you on because I wanted to explain to everybody uh, about the chamber as a whole and, and what the Chamber of Commerce is kind of in general do. And Hazelton, just like many of the chambers across the country, um, focus primarily on making sure our communities continue to function, businesses are coming in, organizations are coming in, and we're all kind of one big happy cohesive family. So um, Mary, I want you to talk a little bit about the Chamber, its mission, um, and, and how we got to where we are today and, and having this great organization that's thriving thanks to hundreds of businesses and organizations right here in our area. That's right. So we start our Chamber Happy New Year, as it were, is on May 1st. Okay. And on May 1st, we'll be celebrating 127 years wow. as a Chamber of Commerce. And our chamber really has always focused on membership association work. So working with whether you're a new business, an mm -hmm. expanding business, a family business, we have a really rich history right here in the greater Hazleton community of second, third, some even fourth generation family businesses and working with them. So I was uh, a, a true believer in the, the theory of three. And so connection, current information, and community would mm -hmm. be how I would, I would sum it up. So the connection, particularly on the business sides, in this day and age, not only the connection to find new customers if you're um, a cleaning service, it, mm -hmm. it is almost spring, so 
uh, a landscaping services as we move into that area. If you're selling a particular product, the hospital, everywhere from a one person shop all the way up to some of our larger mm -hmm. employers in the area, including the hospital and can all benefit from those connections and that networking ability. And sometimes in particular, I think for small business membership or a membership organization, mm -hmm. so all of the businesses do pay an annual dues to us, um, that they uh, can benefit from, you know, we have at least one networking mixer a month, which is a free event right. uh, for anyone to come. Sometimes just to talk to somebody, even if they're not in the same business, sometimes the struggles that you're having, and mm -hmm. I'm always amazed at the partnership and business connections that come, uh, that come out of those networking mixers. It's an ability to stop in, mm -hmm. uh, bring another employee maybe with you to uh, to a networking mixer, the chance to relax. And again, networking mixers are actually hosted at some of our member locations. Mm -hmm. So it's a great way, you know, oh, I've always wondered what that cleaning uh, supply store did, or we are having one uh, shortly at one of our banks. What's different about this particular bank and their services than another? Mm -hmm. So again, I think that connection piece can't can't talk mm -hmm. about it enough about what your membership dues. And then current information, I think, is another aspect. Um, what's the prevailing wage in the greater Hazleton area with our wage and salary survey that mm -hmm. we do? Uh, we, we work with our partner, Can Do, mm -hmm. um, on again, just some local statistics, what's the median household uh, in, income in the area, cost of the mm house, -hmm. what are the bus lines or the taxi services that we have. So a lot of those kind of things. Uh, I, I know also, and you talked a little bit about the um, mixers, there are many or, uh, events that you guys put on each uh, each month. So you have the mixers, you had red carpet breakfasts, you have, um, you know, some yeah, meet and greets, uh, businesses and stuff kind of going along. You have the women's luncheon and, and right. all this stuff. Um, all, all helps businesses and organizations right here in the greater Hazleton area to keep expanding and keep that um, open door so you're getting maybe a bank and you know maybe a business talking and they say well you know what you can come in maybe we can help you uh, right. and stuff like that so having these uh, events are very crucial to keep this this cog moving here this big wheel cog going right and um I'm starting now my fifth year with the, with the chamber. And so over the course of that time, what I've seen as the president is some of the topics, the education topics right. too. Um, social media, uh, our web page, our Facebook page, uh, Twitter, all of Instagram, all of those kind of things, um, not only for the chamber, but also for those, for again, those smaller businesses to show them to have something right here in the greater Hazleton mm -hmm. community, again, to keep everything on a local basis, um, shop local, and uh, to use our, our members, and also to show them the benefits of some of those elements, and always try to keep it at a really reasonable cost so mm -hmm. that you know a half day seminar a one or two hour that they can have their person get out but then get back to mm -hmm. their business and being uh, cognizant um, of that so in the course of the month and again you can't go you can't go with it, go to it all but if you even try we always try to encourage try to attend at least one thing right. the red carpet breakfast is uh, a focus on our legislative our elected officials and again in a smaller environment one-on-one mm -hmm. -on -one, they might give a brief update about what they're working on that's pursuant to our area but then the chance sometimes the most important things are what happens right before or right after when you can actually go up and talk to them right. or ask the questions in the discussion phase of it I, I, again critical critical a long I'll, I'll never forget a long time uh, member of the chamber we did uh, I can't think it was probably last year on the opioid crisis and again with a focus on on business and, mm -hmm. and how that impacted businesses and had some questions for Stephanie Salavantis that was specific again mm -hmm. to a business owner having something occur and how he could best handle it. 
And so, again, our goal is to be helpful and make those critical connections right. for business owners in our community. All right, so uh, we're going to take a short break. Um, for more information on the Chamber, you can head to their website. Uh, the phone number has been up on our screen throughout the thing, and it will continue throughout the show. When we come back, some of the other great uh, opportunities for being a Chamber member uh, and also, one of the things that the Chamber is probably most famous known for is Fun Fest, and we'll be getting ready to kick off uh, another year with that. So stay with us. More coming up right after this. All Care Home Care, providing quality in home care since 1986. Call and see how their team of licensed physical therapists, skilled nurses, speech, and occupational therapists can provide you with exceptional service in the comfort of your own home. They also offer dietitian, home health aid, and medical social worker services. You have a choice in your health care. For safe, friendly, qualified care, call All Care Home Care today and let their team begin taking care of you and your loved ones. Go hog wild for Iron Pigs Baseball. WYLN is televising the Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs live. America's favorite pastime on your local network, WYLN TV 35. See the stars of tomorrow at Coca-Cola Park. Don't miss any of the games here on WYLN TV 35. Visit WYLNTV.com for a complete Iron Pigs schedule. Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs on WYLN, your home for live sports. Get ready for TV that works for you with Service Electric's TiVo Whole Home DVR. Automatically record single shows or an entire series. Record six shows at once and store up to 150 HD hours of programming. The easy-to-use guide helps you find your favorite shows. Start your program in one room and continue watching in another. Stop, pause, and rewind live TV at your leisure. Call or go to secTV.com to add TiVo Whole Home DVR to any Service Electric cable TV service or bundle. Watch off the beaten path on WYLN TV 35 and discover the Pennsylvania you never knew existed. And welcome back to Talking NEPA here on WYLN. Mary Malone from the Chamber joining me. Uh, Mary, we talked about a lot of the uh, business part of the Chamber and, of course, the uh, different events you guys have going on. Uh, also, though, you champion for the nonprofits in the area as well. Uh, and and helping them continue to grow. And I know you have a, a number of nonprofit organizations who are members of the chamber. Correct. Um, but one of those, of course, is FunFest, which kind of came into the chamber um, and continues each and every year in downtown Hazleton. Um, but what people may don't know is that is run primarily by volunteers who come together each year to do this. And, and we'll be starting to kick off FunFest this year, correct? That's right. So this will be our 41st uh, Fun Fest, and it really has been volunteers at its core from the very start of it. Joe Scarcella, still mm -hmm. a very active member of the committee, was part of the founding fathers, as it were, and it's really turned into a family event. We have some second generation volunteers, uh, including Joe's son, mm -hmm. that work with us each year, but everything from picking the theme and planning, doing some of the fundraising for mm -hmm. the events, and it was started and has really stayed true to a way to gather our community, whether it be churches or nonprofit groups or sports leagues together the first weekend after Labor Day weekend, so this year will be the 7th and 8th, mm -hmm. in our downtown area with a fantastic parade um, and some booths and a way for some of those nonprofits not only to get the word out there about what they do, to do a little bit of fundraising, but just an all time, an old fashioned street festival. Uh, and then with free entertainment, mm -hmm. family friendly has always been at its core. Uh, and, and another one of those longtime staples of the Hazleton community, even though it has seen some changes over the years, it is still hold true. Of course, we still have the parade. We have all that great entertainment that comes to downtown, uh, all major parts of this. Along with Fun Fest, and some people may or may not know, um, 
in with the Chamber of Commerce, we have the Downtown Hazleton Alliance for Progress. Um, and I want to just touch on them for a minute. Krista Snyder and, and, and I'll do a fantastic job and, and really have been bringing money to downtown Hazleton. We're seeing new life put into some of our buildings that people thought we would never see again. And that continues to go. We, we're seeing a lot of work being done kind of between Wyoming and Laurel Street right now sure. um, with the Art League and then some of the new buildings, the old bingo building being renovated. Um, that has to be a big, huge shot in the arm to the downtown Hazleton area. It is. And I think, again, we, we talked about connection mm -hmm. in the, the previous segment and connection from the standpoint of the affiliates. So I talked about our partners at Can Do, mm -hmm. DHAB, the civic partnership that also runs the Rails to Trails, our leadership now through our junior leadership, mm -hmm. which gets towards our the younger folks in our community and, and teaching them about community service, volunteering, community impact are all elements. And by having us all housed in one location, sharing office, as well as being efficient for us as organizations, it also gives us the opportunity, I think, to work more closely together mm -hmm. and, um, and, so, and build off of each other's. Krista's might be in downtown, Hazleton is her focus, mm -hmm. um, but the chamber and we work together closely on the farmer's market right. um, in the summertime and we work with Power and Dehab for First Fridays, again, to bring people into the downtown area. But again, it, it allows us all to, uh, the synergy I think of one plus one can equal four or five right. when, you, when you get to that connection formula. Um, the Chamber is one of those organizations that people can call or go onto the website and get just about any any type of information you want, whether it's about businesses that operate here, you know, uh, the locations and stuff like that. Um, and a big push you guys mo most recently have been on your website and drawing people there because not only obviously you can learn about what's going on with the Chamber but other things as well. And you guys have a big push on the calendar, community right. calendar, chamber calendar. So people can see what's going on and, and take advantage of some of the great uh, organizations and events that are happening. Right, and so just to plug again for chamber membership, uh, we only carry on our directory chamber members. Mm -hmm. And that has information, their phone number, their location, their hours, uh, a piece of a little blurb about what type of services or specialties that they have there. And the Chamber's website, both for folks in town and out of town, does get a lot of traffic. So that's definitely another perk um, of membership. But for any community organization out there, they can go onto our website under calendar of mm -hmm. events there's actually a drop down that you can actually post. So if your firehouse is having a sale, if your church group or your school group is doing something, I mean, we're getting into the time mm -hmm. period now where the calendar is gonna get really busy. We have a lot of organizations that also, uh, I know our Rotary Club is planning on an event to happen in August. They've already put it up onto the web page so that if another community mm -hmm. group is looking to put something on there, they can double check dates so uh, so that you don't want to bump into to something all right to something else. And then that will automatically the way our system and our software works, that'll also come up to uh, the chamber's Facebook page. Wonderful. Again, it's so high traffic, um, a community service that's important. Mm -hmm. uh, to us for all entities, whether you're a chamber member or not. Um, you alluded to a little earlier that this is your fifth year uh, as the president of the chamber. In those five years, um, we've seen a, a lot has changed in the way we're getting information out there, of course, the social media and all that. Uh, from your standpoint, good, bad, and different that you're seeing all this high traffic now on the internet with, with everything? What I, what I always... Uh, Thank you for asking, the good, it is a good question. It's good to have uh, those elements and those mm -hmm. tools, but I can't stress enough to, to folks, even if it's just to pop in for 45 minutes to a mixer, that face-to-face -face element. Mm -hmm. um, even if, you know, again, once a month, 
to get to whether it's a women's networking lunch or but to get yourself out there uh, so it's great to have that as a backup mm -hmm. and it and it does good communication and all of that but don't lose sight of the one-on-one -on -one touch and the ability all of those events uh, our women's networking lunches have resource tables and I I'm always amazed for um, again those networking mixers I never realized that this particular chiropractor also had this service in their office or I didn't realize that this bank had this particular specialty so there's nothing like getting right. that that face-to-face -face time all right, we're going to take a break uh, right there. We'll be right back with more here on Talking NEPA. It's spring, and savings are in the air during the spring sales event at All-American Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. Shop our large inventory and drive off with a great deal. Lease a new Jeep Compass Latitude 4x4 for $189 a month. And during Ram Truck Month, get select Ram 1500 4x4s for as low as $32,890. Or get 0% for 72 months on the Ram 1500. Savings are in the air during the spring sales event at All-American Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. Join us this week on Let's Talk Chiropractic. You'll meet Rhonda, who's going to tell you how laser therapy helped her get back on her feet after a bad ankle break. Her story this week on Let's Talk Chiropractic. Join us. Ventwood Whitetail, graduation, birthday, bachelor, reunion parties, they have the most tranquil backyard experience with beautiful mountains in the background. If your company or business wants a different alternative to a golf outing, they have outings that can accommodate you. You can have the entire facility to yourself. They will work with you to set up your day of events, sporting clay competitions, trap and wobble trap games, skeet. After a day of shooting, you'll return to a meal designed for you. Call Mike at 570-535-6123 for available group options. Hi, I'm Julia Wiegand, the newest news reporter for WYLN News. I'm so proud to be part of your number one local news team. WYLN News. When local news happens, you can count on WYLN News to be there. Whether it's in Berwick, Tamaqua, or right here in Hazleton. We work hard to be your number one local news station and will continue to work hard to stay number one. And welcome back here to Talking NEPA. We're finishing up here with Mary Malone. Mary, there's a lot that goes on with the chamber, especially if you're a new business, if you want to be involved in it. So step one is membership. And, and you have people in the chamber uh, who handle different parts of it. And, and of course, uh, membership, big part. Correct. So that would be Dan Guidish mm -hmm. is our membership director. And the great piece about Dan is he'll literally come out to the business, even if you're just interested, and talk to you about all the benefits that are available to you mm -hmm. once you join the and kind of give you the, the lay of the land. And that one on one contact, I think, is key. Then we also have a critical part of our team is Leanne Falabelle. She is the Vice President of Marketing. She handles our education, setting up of our events, our women's networking, mm -hmm. and our two large events as far as exposure to the greater Hazleton community, our business expo that happens with our annual meeting mm -hmm. in May, and then our large, one of the biggest golf tournaments uh, that always happens every year in annual, where there's an on court on golf course trade show. Um, so if you call the main or main number for the Chamber of Commerce, you can uh, go ahead and get in touch with, we'll put you in touch mm -hmm. with the right person. And this is also great. So, you know, we, we've talked about some of the other things. Ribbon cuttings for businesses, you know, a big deal. We get new businesses open or businesses that may be relocating or remodeling. This is a great thing for them to show off. It is. And the other piece is we have a fantastic relationship with our media partners. Mm -hmm. And also with our legislative partners. So to have someone from Representative Two Hills office come out or Congressman Cartwright's office to your ribbon cutting and truly welcome you to be mm -hmm. part of our business community. Uh, so that's a great thing. Another on the community side as well that we have coming up each spring, we work in coordination with our municipality partners mm -hmm. to participate in the Great PA Cleanup, which will be the Saturday after Easter Sunday, so the 27th. And we invite, again, 
church groups, Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, a service club in your school, mm -hmm. a neighborhood to really go ahead and take care of our community and clean it up because spring is finally <laughs> knocking. <laughs> yeah, so we got a, a lot of things that go on that you guys make sure happen. And, and uh, what you may not always know is that, you know, the chamber um, is always in the background making sure all these things happen. The great PA cleanup, making sure we get people going out there. Of course, making sure many other events happen and, and kind of the backbone to that. So another great organization, if you are a business owner or a nonprofit organization, you know, reach out to the chamber, give them a call uh, because there's different avenues you can take with the chamber, uh, partner up with them, become a member, uh, and it has a lot of great benefits for you uh, throughout uh, the greater Hazleton area. On top of you work well with the neighboring chambers as well, partner up with some things uh, that happen too. Absolutely. Uh, with our southern partners in the Schuylkill Chamber of mm -hmm. Commerce, to our north we have both Wilkes-Barre, Pittston, and the Scranton Chamber, and occasionally we'll work together on a, on a big education event mm -hmm. or a hot topic, and so, and always talking. Like I said, can't impress upon folks enough about um, the web page and again calling the office and we'll, we'll get you connected mm -hmm. to where you need to go. Um, Mary, as we're coming to the close of the show, um, you know, for you as sitting uh, in the chair as a chamber of president, um, some of the big key points that you want everyone to know, resident, business owner, community leader, whatever it is, what do you want them to know about the greater Hazleton area and why it's so important for everyone to be involved? We have a great mix of family businesses in mm -hmm. our area and some really unique stories. The, the piece about is sharing those talents mm -hmm. with the community as a whole and helping to get the word out there, both in our community and even beyond any PA so that folks are able to use those services. And I'm um, kind of, there's a saying, and I don't know who it's attributed to about kind of bloom where you are planted. So if you're planted here mm -hmm. for the business day or for your home and your kids, why not get involved? and participate, even if it's only in one aspect of it mm -hmm. a year, to make it a better place for all of us. You're absolutely correct. Again, the Greater Hazleton Chamber of Commerce, a great organization. If you want to learn more about that, hazeltonchamber.org, the phone number as well. Give them a call. Uh, know what goes on here. Go to their website. See what goes on in the Greater Hazleton area. Use their calendar. Learn about events. Come out to a mixer. I, I know we, we've been, uh, been to many of them. Red Carpet Breakfast is also a great way to know what's going on in Harrisburg and in Washington. Uh, again, the chamber does phenomenal work. Mary thank you so much for coming on and, and talking with us. Thanks and good luck with the new thank show. Thank you. We're so excited. <laughs> we're so excited to have Talking NAPA here. We're, we're basing it in Hazleton, but we have a far reach uh, that we are so excited to share all the great things that are going on, not only here in Hazleton, but across northeastern Pennsylvania as well. And we have a lot of great shows lined up for you here starting uh, in April. And we thank uh, Mary for helping us kick it off here with show number two. Thanks for joining us, everyone. We'll see you next time here on Talking NEPA.